Eight hours after vertical ear canal ablation, there's a bit of swelling and some bleeding. The bleeding has been uh, washed off and the dog is, will be given painkillers, antibiotics and hospitalized for two days. And uh, so far so good, there is no uh, breakdown. The vertical canal has been removed and what you see is the horizontal canal opening. Here the horizontal canal opening and uh, the drainage cartilage. The top one two-thirds of the vertical canal has been cut it off. So there should be less problem now. What happened is there's an abscessed tumor inside the vertical canal and and the dog had been scratching and there was very bad smell of pus for the last few weeks the owner was uh, was uh, overseas so nobody cleaned up the ear after that he went to one vet who who referred him to another vet for surgery so i had the dog on two weeks of treatment antibiotics and painkillers and uh, the dog was operated yesterday the uh, july 16 2014 with the two-thirds of the vertical canal removed by Dr. Daniel and th this is the post-op results as you can see this operation is called vertical canal vertical canal ablation and uh, post-op is very important July 17 to 014 9 8